Hello, this is Rhonda Finfrock of Fruitful Life Studio, and you are watching the DIY A Go Go YouTube channel. It's a beautiful, gorgeous, sunny California day, and it was time to get out of my studio, come outside, take a walk. So I thought I would record this part of my video outside in our orange grove where it's nice, sunny, and warm. I'm here to tell you the story of the DIY do-over. This painting here, I absolutely love it, but it wasn't always so. This is what it looked like before the DIY do-over. It wasn't until the very last step when I was applying the big top sealer that I decided, no, this was not going to do. I didn't really like the contrast. There was just too much contrast. And so for a while, I just put it away. Now, just recently it happened. I remembered the painting. It was the day I got my DIY order. It was like pennies from heaven. Actually, it is called pennies from heaven. It's the new copper patina from DIY. And then it hit me. That's my answer. I can do a DIY do-over. DIY paint is perfect for layering. I first applied DIY Water Lily, and then my favorite, Apothecary. I brushed it on, then spritzed it with the Water Girl Continuous Sprayer, and then dabbed it back to get it just how I wanted it. Next up, I painted a layer of blue iris. I just love that color. I dabbed some Hay Sailor on the border to cover up the previous stencil. I wanted to give the stenciled area more depth, so I first applied Hay Sailor to give it a nice rich color underneath. Get most of the paint off your brush before stenciling, that's offloading. Stippling means to pounce gently up and down at a 90 degree angle. This time, instead of stenciling the border, I decided to use an IOD stamp to stamp on the beautiful copper patina. I made this mask at a 45 degree angle using an IOD thin mount. I sanded the IOD stamp lightly because it was new to give it a tooth to hold the paint. I rolled on the pennies from heaven patina and then stamped the border of my painting.
I'm pouncing along the edges using my JRV stencil brush to fill in the little spaces that the stamp didn't get. No, I don't want it to look perfect. I want it to look weathered and old. To have DIY paint delivered right to your door, contact your local retailer or visit FruitfulLifeStudio.com. Thanks and have a great day. What will be your next DIY do-over? <music>